Hello and welcome back to another episode from our series called Building with Lime. In this series, we are creating awareness about the benefits of lime as a construction material and how you can incorporate it into your construction project. A simple and easy way to incorporate lime into your um, home or office is to use it as a surface finish. Um, we are not talking about a polished surface finish, but just simply a textured surface finish like the kind you see behind me. This is very easy for you to do and you can do this even if the civil structure of your house or office or building has been made with the use of cement. Uh, for us, a lime surface finish is any layer that is applied up to 8 mm thick. Anything thicker for us then becomes a civil work specification where you can go back to the standard lime, sand and or pozzolan um, mix where when you're dealing with thicknesses more than 8 mm. For thicknesses thinner than that, you need to change the kind of aggregate you're using. River sand, for example, if you put a 4 mm layer or a 2 mm, that's just going to dust off. It's not going to gain strength. So then the question is what kind of aggregates are suitable to combine with the same fundamental line binder so that they become strong at these thinner dimensions. So the favorite, the most popular is marble dust, graded marble dusts. And that's also what we provide at M Lime as, um, as, as red, our ready mixes in what we call the play series. By varying uh, the particle size of this marble dust, you can create a whole variety of uh, mixes which will offer you coarser and then subsequently finer finishes. This surface finish is actually made with a mix of lime and marble dust and you can add any pigment into it to get the color of your choice and simply slap it onto your walls the way you would put any kind of an application to get this kind of an effect. This textured surface finish is not waterproof like the polished lime surface finishes, but it does bring in the benefits of lime into your living space. Uh, it brings in the non-toxicity, the, you know, the sustainable nature, the breathability and the thermal comfort as well as the insect repelling properties that this material has. In our experience, doing these textured surface finishes with lime and marble mix was quite easy to implement on site. It required almost no new training of any sort for our artisans and they took to it very comfortably. A wonderful quality of this textured finish is that it's very breathable and it allows moisture to come in and go out. So, you know, typically if there's dampness on your wall, you will see your paint starting to flake and sort of peel off. But in the case of a textured finish with lime, you don't have that issue. Even if you do see some dampness coming into your walls, it will with time as the season and the weather changes, it will dry up and leave absolutely no stain behind. We have used this textured uh, surface finish very extensively in our uh, project. We've added some interesting colors to it and you know brightened up our walls and our rooms uh, wherever needed uh, and it's it's really provided a great um, sort of contrast and complement to our rammed earth walls. Um, at M Lime, we call this series of material the play series because um, they are that playful, they are that easy to manipulate and um, just as I'm walking around Manisha's property as well, I can see how she's also with her workers created site specific textures that um that that i hadn't uh, that i hadn't seen before and that we as a business never uh, categorize specially and sell to our customers so there's rough there's matte there's what manisha has done which is like a kind of a sort of a patchwork of polished and matte 
and then there is a unsealed polish finish where we are not applying soap where we are not introducing stearic acid so um this range and i'm sure uh, there's there's many more degrees of each of these uh, possible another one of our customers did mix our heavier aggregate and our fine aggregate our coarse and fine materials to create an in between grain and these are single layer applications far less complicated uh, or far less uh, demanding than the precision that polish line requires i would strongly encourage you to start experimenting with uh these kind of textured uh surface finishes because they are very easy to incorporate into any kind of a civil structure a uh, very easy to implement very accessible in terms of material and pigments and great fun to work with thank you for watching this video and if you like the content that we are creating do subscribe to our youtube channel and click on the notification icon to be reminded of every new video that we put out there thanks for watching